What is up guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we have the Chris Smalling SBC, the actual one, the 87 rated one. He won the first footies category for uh, the first week of footies. Of course, 87 rated center back does look like a ridiculous card. I do go ahead and buy him or get him from the SBC. He's 50k, you don't have any other players, but for me he's basically free because I had every single player in my club. So I got him for free. He's in my club now. And yeah, we do go into the game in for the daily knockout tournament. That's the game we do have and we do get the foot birthday put, uh, pack at the end of this video uh, so you guys can see what I get I don't get anything too great or maybe I do who knows I might but we do start off with Theo Walcott of course you guys haven't seen my team let me tell you guys about my team that I did use in the daily knockout tournament so of course the requirements meant that you could only have uh, three players that weren't from a nation that were the other eight so you had to have at least eight players from the same nation so you could have eight english players and then three players that weren't from england which is what i did and i had dwight gale team of the season which cost me 50k is pretty cheap uh walcott which was 50k as well for the right wing spot pretty cheap and then i used the rest of the team that was in my club and i bought barkley for center mid and it was great i played barkley chan and ali center mids they were fantastic barkley scored some bangers you guys will see towards the end of the video um but yeah we do go up two nil as dwight Gale, the man from Newcastle, just slotted into the bottom left corner, man. He is a machine. His dribbling's a bit iffy, not the greatest. He's a bit stiff on the ball, but apart from that, man, he is a great striker. Go ahead and try him out if you do want to. Theo Walcott really impressed me, man. He's a great right winger, probably better than uh, Team of the Season Mane, in my opinion. I wouldn't go ahead and buy Team of the Season Mane. I just have him because he's untradeable, of course, but if you do have, like, only 50k or less than 100k to spend on a right winger go for uh theo walcott because theo walcott is just a goal scoring machine his low driven shots are great his pace is crazy his dribbling is fantastic man and i just love theo walcott on this game so much i just don't use him because i i can just use money and money does almost the same thing but i like walcott i prefer walcott over money in my opinion but Mertens does get the ball down the uh right hand side does slot it in into eric by eric by Taps it in. Sweaty goal. What am I going to do? Mertens is ridiculous, by the way. I have 1.6 million coins, and I can do whatever team I want around him. Of course, you guys saw that video. Go check it out. Um, it is basically the video before this one. Um, but yeah, Mertens is ridiculous. He's so good. I it, It's crazy how good he is because he can hit it from anywhere, and it will be most likely a goal. And it's ridiculous, dude. I, I don't even want to think how good his 95 Mertens is because I just... But yeah, I wanted to make a team around him. I don't know if I'm going to. I think I might, but I think I might keep Mertens on the bench and bring him on as a sub right away because I don't know how to fit a team around him unless I do full Belgium, which I don't want to because I want to use meta players um, so I can perform well in the weekend league and hopefully get elite soon. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that, but we do beat this guy 5-0. He does rage quit in the 70th minute, which was pretty nice to see. Emery Chan getting men in the match right there, not getting the ball because the game didn't end. But Yang and Biwa got like 8 out of 10 tackles, dude. That's 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 pretty ridiculous. I know I use the word ridiculous a lot, but we do win the second game. I think that was the second game. Might have been the first game. I'm not too sure, but we do come up against Mbappe, Lacazette, Depreville, Sanson, Conte, uh, Ben Arfa. Decent team. Great French team. This guy literally could tackle everything. He he was doing it, the perfect tackles at the perfect time. He knew where I was going every single day, every single time, any single day. He knew where I was going. A any any day he would know where I was going. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna just what forget about that. Okay. He does cross it in with Mbappe and the boy Lack is sweaty does manage to head it into the goal very easily by himself. There's no one there. Look at this goal by Barkley, dude. Okay, so he lays it off to Ali. Ali back to Barkley, and Barkley curls it in. What a goal by Ross, the boss. Barkley, man. He's 2,000 coins for some reason. I'm not too sure why. He should be, like, probably near discard, but he's still a great player, man. Great card, really impressed me. I think he had played, like, eight games with him and scored four goals and got three assists, which for a center midfielder, not a cam. He didn't play cam at all. For a center midfielder, is a great, great, great record. Mertens does manage to finesse it into the top right corner. Puts us up 2-1 in the 40th minute. Mertens coming in as a sub, of course. I think I put him in that, that cam spot, maybe left forward spot. I'm not too sure. But Mertens is disgusting. So good, how I said. I just, I can't get enough of Mertens, dude. He's... Arguably my favorite player on this game when he's like on form and 
when he's on form, he just tears everything up. Same with Hyung Ming Son. I, I, I like Hyung Ming Son more when he's on form. Like when I can, I can actually perform with him and score goals. But look at this goal by Mertens, dude. I think this is a goal by Mertens. No, it's not. Okay. Um, actually, no. It is a goal by Mertens. Mertens does manage to score. Right, watch. We win the ball back with Ali in the midfield. Right wing does get the ball. Mertens sees the space. Takes the shot. Hits the top. Bounces on the bottom. What a goal by Dries Mertens, dude. Look, that's... And he does. He he has a he has a brace as a sub. He does get a penalty in like the 80th minute. Uh, in in the 88th minute, I was like, okay, whatever. Who cares? We're up 3-1. If he scores this, he scores this. I should have saved this. Don't know what happened. I'm pretty sure it just went through his leg. But I was like, okay, I'm just gonna waste time. We have like less than two minutes. We managed to win the game 3-1 or 3-2. So just fine. Barkley gets man of the match. I think he got a goal and like an assist or something. But this is where the corrupted gameplay comes in as well. I don't know what happened. What, what causes this to happen? But you guys will see a bunch of green on the screen. I think I just sped it up. Every I just all, sped it all up. This is of course the third game of the daily knockout tournament. Um, every by the way, from now on, from now on to the end of the video is corrupted. So if you guys just want to skip to the end and watch the foot birthday pack, go ahead, leave a like on the video, and yeah, just skip in like just skip like probably I don't know six thirteen. Just skip like to the mi minute around eight. And it will be right there because this is just all going to be corrupted because um, it's just really messed up. So uh, we go up 2-0 in the third game. That's fine. 60th minute. So I was like pretty confident right here. I was telling myself, okay, I can win this. If I win this game, I'm guaranteed the final because I'm not, I, I know I'm not going to choke the final. So we go up 3-0, I'm pretty sure. And that was just fine. We do manage to win that game 3-0. I think this guy rage quits or what happens? I'm not too sure. But um, this guy has a 420 clan tag, of course. But. Mertens, another goal you see in the background. So we go into the next game. I didn't show the team, but we go up 1-0 in the beginning. And I just I just score so many goals this game. I Dwight Gale was on another level. I put a stat card on him, actually. I put a dribbling stat card. I know I said his dribbling wasn't that great. That's why I put a stat card on him. Made him to 99 dribbling. Felt a bit better on the ball. Still a bit clunky, but we do go up 2-0 by the, I don't know what minute is that, like 10th, 15th minute. Uh, with Theo Walcott, so 2 0 up in 10 minutes in the final. I'm like, okay, dude, I, I, I should be able to to win this from now on. Dwight Gale, 15 minutes in, I think 20 minutes in, just managed to make it 3 0. I'm like, okay, I should be cruising by now. 4 0, Dwight Gale with another goal, low driven shot, left foot, great, great, great. 24th minute, he does pause it. I'm like, okay, is this a rage quit? No, it wasn't. He brought on like some great players, and I'm like, okay, so I bring on Mertens. Um, switch to a 4 1 2 formation. I'm like, okay, this should be great, this should be fine. Let's just score one more goal, and then he should be gone. I think I do score one more goal. I'm not too sure. But when we do open the foot birthday pack, I was a bit disappointed. I'm not going to lie. I, I, I'm just saying this right now because I know a lot of people already sk skipped through in the video, but the green, the screen just went completely green. Uh, by the way, stop talking about green screens. I probably, uh, there we go, 5-0, by the way, by Dwight Gale. I think that's his hat trick. Um, but I really want to get a green screen behind me. I'm going to try and see if I can get that uh, sorted out. But right here, we do have the foot birthday player. I hope you guys did enjoy. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, as we do get Wowieton, who's only like 14K. So I was like, whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. More videos coming soon for you guys. Leave, leave me a comment saying hello. And yeah, see you guys in the next video. Have a fantastic day.